Just jump yeah, in. Get fucking, in. What are we talking about? Yeah, what get you in got? here. What you got? It's on the docket. It's on the docket today? Okay. A little- Sam can't do this without having the stupid, awkward smile about it. <laughs> you see, when you ever tell <laughs> Sam to like look at a camera or like, do a shit, no, I'm expect terrible. his fucking awkward little <laughs> chuckle to just appear. I'm just an awkward person, okay? <laughs> it is what it is. But anyway, story time with Sam. Um, Dope. I'm doing groceries the other day. Groceries. You know, going about my business. The groceries. And then going down the aisle, trying to get some Cheez-Its. And then Dope. Um, there's a mom and, and a son behind me walking. The son's just like kind of swinging around like a bag of avocados. I'm like, okay, sure, uh-huh. whatever. I go to reach um, for, the, for the Cheez-Its. Sorry? Healthy kid. Yeah, seemed like it. <laughs> you know, these are fucking avocados, bro. Doing these that. Radio, so. But then the bag ripped. So it's like an avocado like fella kind of rolled like past me and then like went underneath the aisle so I like, couldn't really get it. Yeah. But like me and the kid kind of like looked at it and I was just like, it's avocado, isn't it, buddy? <laughs> I was just like, yes. I didn't even give a shit. Because he probably didn't even get he, it. He fucking loved it. That's oh, the thing. Okay. He's like, oh, mommy, that guy made a funny <laughs> joke. I'm like, yes. And his mom kind of looked at me like reluctant. He'd be like, he's probably going to shake. Hot mom? Yeah, she's all right. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Nice. <laughs> nice. Right? Fucking pun game coming in pretty slick there. That's hilarious. That's funny, man. Yeah, the mom was like, yes, yes, son. Like, I've heard his name. Yes, he's an idiot. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he made a funny joke. Look at me, like, fucking reluctantly. Like, you f- you just, this kid's going to say this all night probably now. Yeah. I'm like, you know what? Hey, imagine he'd go- <laughs> How young was he? I would say, like, six or seven. Uh, imagine he, like, tells a story. Maybe around there, maybe he older. He tell a story about you. The guy at the grocery store told him about the Avogano. Yeah. <laughs> you know? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? And that's the guy at the grocery store was just like it's avocado. I was like, what? And like, it's getting real soft here for a second, but like, Ooh. I think that's like a change you can make in somebody's life. Just so like, I did something to a random stranger that I feel like you was brighten like, somebody's day. Yeah, exactly. I feel like feels that, good. Yeah, it's it like it's, it's my purpose. It's not, but it feels <laughs> it's good. It's my purpose to make other people feel good. Okay, well, it, it's just an actual thing humans should do be anyways. everybody's purpose. Yeah, it should, yeah, exactly. it should just be a thing. Yep. But I mean, some people, eh, people take have more pride days. in that than others. People have their days. Yes. Well, because mercury has been in retrograde. Oh, God. If you didn't know, I had a couple people bring it up to me at work. I'm like, what? Yeah. And they're like, and then, what did they say? Because we looked it up. And remember, it was like, Honestly, the way she explained it to me too was just like. Let's look it up again. Uh, um, Keep cause, going. Because she was talking about her husband that she works with, the guy who was super into this shit. So like her husband is. Yeah, or her works with the guy is. So like she was saying, like he complains about that shit. But April's like, no, this is like. Yeah, look, the final Mercury retrograde of 2021 is dead. here. How oh. your sign should prepare, not you. Well, it's just like expect bad things to happen. Pretty much, it's a weird. Things like that, it's because they're retrograde. Like people might act weird. Like bad things happen. Like at work, the past two days have been a fucking oh, it means to adventure. move backwards. So okay, we're moving backwards. Mercury's in retrograde, so it's like a time of, you know, going back. And the way she explained it to me yeah, was just here. Go on. Just like it's either something like bad might happen, like might be weird stuff or whatever. Like I'm like, isn't that just? Any day? Okay, yeah, no, that's she explained it. Poorly. She explained it very, very I just poorly. Looked it up, and, and, and it's like, so much easier to understand. It said to move backwards. Yeah. So that literally means she said like, it was nothing like that. Yeah, like literally the way I can think of it is two steps forward, one step back. You know what I mean? So yeah. it's like you ne- you're in that one step back period. Well, it was just so like a to take two like, steps forward. Probably. The way she explained it was a very like pessimistic. She's an idiot. Yeah, she kind of is, but like. So. Kind of Hopefully she doesn't watch this, Sam. Pessimistic way to look Hopefully at it. Hopefully she doesn't watch this. <laughs> well, I, I, I was ripping her the past couple days for it. Like, other people work have been kind of doing it, too. Like, oh, Mercury's in retrograde. This is why this is oh, happening. True. Yeah, you're all going to get in trouble. Uh, <laughs> no, we'll be fine. She doesn't give a fuck. Yeah. We're, we're, all, we're all pretty cool there. That's it's pretty fucking cool dumb. Place. Yeah. Pretty fucking chill. Fucking sick there. workplace. Random question for you, Matt. Okay. If, you know, there's always that question of, like, which like five people could you like take out to dinner with or something? Who'd you want to bring back to life to like talk to? Like, okay. like who's somebody you wouldn't want to go out to dinner with or have dinner with? Hannibal Lecter. I mean, that's an excellent call, <laughs> but that's like I was kind of thinking more like an actual Ooh, like, Batman. He'd be person. boring. Bat. Yeah, but then he'd leave halfway through. That's what I'm saying. You'd he'd be, be stuck worst. paying for it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> and he'd be so boring. Too, I gotta like. go fight crime. All right, see you, Batman. What do you want? To, did, did I, I can't up. do a Batman. What do you want to get? Where is Rachel? I can't. Yeah, I can't do Batman. 
Yeah, well, Christian Bale's Batman is the easiest one to do. I can't say I can Rachel. quote past Batman. I could do Batman. It I, I could do it if I talk really low. Yeah. Does he talk low? No. Kind of. He he projects. It's more yeah, like gr like gr more. grunt. Yeah, I can't do that. Like more force. Where's Rachel? Well, that kind of well, like that someone, one was like. Where's Rachel? Book. You're like the comic book Batman. Too many jillikers, Batman. <laughs> Pow. <laughs> <Le -pang>. Pow. <laughs> Fuck. Fucking slobber what knocker again. What? Like the personifications. Yeah. What of it? We know shit. I know shit. No shit. A thing I, or two. I was a gifted. Thing or two. I was labeled as gifted at a young age, Sam. The fourth grade. Yeah. I took a gifted test. Got ninety eight percent on it. No big deal. Wow. Well, well, go you. Look at where it got him today, folks. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry to disappoint. Yeah, it was interesting to be honest. Uh. I feel like I didn't find out what that really meant until like my later years. You know, like I got identified as gifted. Yes. Like at like math and language and problem solving. But like math back then is, you know, fucking plus and minus and addition, multiplication, that kind of shit. Yeah. I said Which twice. I still have difficulty with now. But well, sure. Know, a lot of people is. like do, especially the older people get. Yeah, but um, the, I really like the older that I got. Like my parents used to say, like, you're too smart for your own good. And stuff like that. And I never really yeah. knew like what that meant, but I think it was more like uh like if I didn't want to do it and I could figure out a reason, like a good reason why I didn't need to do it, I wouldn't do it. Right? Yeah. I think that's kind of more what they meant. Like in terms of like too smart for my own good, like getting myself into trouble like that. But Yeah, it's kinda of being like your all my own worst enemy sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stuff yeah. like that. Like all my report cards forever always said like I worked too fast right that's because I always just wanted to get it done to this do something that I wanted to do pain in the ass yeah yeah right kid doesn't shut the fuck up no 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 like I would finish work really quickly I'd still do really well but they would all say like if he just slowed down he would do even better right but it's like the reason I wasn't slowing down is that, because that it wasn't like a, good it wasn't fun enough sounds like a shitty cop out answer in what? a way, like, oh, he's, he just needs to slow down. That's, you're doing that's too That's actually so funny that you're you doing it. too I good. I never thought of that. You need to slow the fuck down, man. No, like, they said, because I could be doing better, right? Like, yeah. if I just took the time to, like, check my work, that kind of thing. Like, yeah. they weren't wrong. But it's funny that you mentioned that. Not because I've never thought about it like that. All the teachers have the same answer. It's like, yo, do your jobs better. Yeah, like, oh, do your jobs better. Those fucking. I'm saying progress reports. But no, I'm, that's I'm probably like why the, I was gifted. The mid the mid year ones you get, where the fuck does it call? I'm blank on the name right now. Oh yeah, where like it's needs like improvement, eight. satisfactory. Like, yeah, yeah. do you remember you realize like, oh, these are all just fucking computer generated. They just input yeah, a name and it's like, at the different oh, level. This is also okay. just A, B, C, and D. Yeah, literally, your teacher is just doing fucking twenty five of those. The beginning of getting manipulated by language, right there. You know. Yeah. Uh, I, oh, this isn't. Oh no, this isn't your report cards. You don't get A, B, C's, and D's. No, this is. No, no, no. You get E's, S's, N's, what? and whatever the last one is. No, oh, the needs improvement, satisfactory, excellent, and yeah. What's the last? One? Excellent. Good. No. Hey. No, it's satisfactory, needs exactly. improvement, and then there's there's like the shitty one. Them, and was it? the worst, right? Needs improvement. Yeah. You know, they're different. I feel like that was just more of just like the personality report card as opposed to like your other report card with, like, with yeah, your marks like, on it. Like, like your habits, like your work habits. Yeah, stuff like that. Yeah, that Fucking, makes sense. Yeah, personality test. Yeah, that makes sense. It was dumb, though. Do you remember yeah, the EQAO testing? Yes. We had to do like a week of testing? Yeah. Why? Probably statistics. Just to gather statistics. Sure. But and that like, makes a lot of sense. It does. But it doesn't make sense why we didn't do it more. Like, we did it, like, once in the second grade. Like, what's so good about the second yeah, grade? Yeah, there was one high school, wasn't there? What's so good about the second grade? Was there? I think so. Cause I remember doing one at uh, St. Mary's. What was that grade 10? Interesting. Okay, I forgot all about that. Must have blanked that out. Well, yeah, but, like, the... No, I say not English test, but, like, literacy test? Literacy test. I think that's uh, what it was. That sounds, yeah, lit test. That's yeah. Familiar. It was like great around grade what ten was that? or so. I remember it was just like reading and writing. If I recall, there was nothing like lame mathematics. It was more like the 
paradoxical thinking or way you're writing shit. Like I remember writing like a page of essay or something. I hated that shit. See, that's where going back to the thing. Um, I think I've told you like ninth grade, like I got caught plagiarizing an essay. Yeah. Cause it was like, cause I didn't want to do it. You know, like it's not that I, I couldn't do it. I literally plagiarized I didn't do it. the sample essay I got for all my teacher's classes, handed it to him, gave me an 84 on it. And I didn't even like yeah. know about it. I, I told him when I dropped out of the yeah. class to go to like applied because an academic English still, I think in grade 12, I'm like, I don't need this. Yeah. This fucking- yeah, yeah. I did that with religion class. I went down because I was like, I don't want to work hard in this class. That's another example. Yeah. Here's another example right there. Me being like, yo, like I'm, I don't want to waste my time. I don't want to like, waste my energy yeah. focusing on something that I don't want to focus on. Yeah. Cause like, honestly, I Hence don't. That's why I went into like the I, arts. Right. Like, yeah, I, I didn't mind English. I somehow seem to be like, always good at it. Oh, but I have fucking hardest time talking. Eleventh and twelfth <laughs> grade, bro. I loved English. One of my favorite classes. I hated English, but then in eleventh grade, I started to like it. In the twelfth grade, because I started smoking weed for one thing. Yeah, he's caught in fucking rambling on story of some no, shit. No, not just better conversations. Even man, the teachers like you talked about. You read books, but you talked about why. You know, like in the books, it was always like, why? Yeah. Actually, I didn't mind the books I read for most of Me my too. classes. I didn't mind them either. Some of them were shit. Third. That's that one essay that I plagiarized. It was a stupid book. I didn't want to read. Yeah, I think it was Brave New World. One Brave I, New World was a great book. I think I, I plagiarized the sample essay I gave you. I didn't read it at all. Brave New World was, to me, is what's happening now. Yeah. Like, yeah. I, I People think say 1984, like, 1984, but they yeah. probably haven't read Brave New World. True. And also, I I read uh, Lord of the Flies. I that was classic. Yeah. I liked reading that more than I wa- we watched the movie at the end yeah, too. The old one though. Yeah, it's bullshit. It's like eh. yeah. Piggy. I think I, I think Piggy. You, I think you could, you could do like a modern. They've done them. There's like takes on them. Yeah, it's Simpsons that, episode. True. Pretty iconic Simpsons episode. Yeah. <clears throat> I think you could do some kind of trippy, trippy way of redoing that. Like we're doing everything nowadays, anyways. Yeah, like a really like dark one. You mean? Yeah, because mm. there is some dark stuff in that book. Yeah, oh yeah, like some of the shit they do. If uh, they you're eat like each other, yeah, if you're like yeah, tribalism and shit, yeah, pretty dark. Yeah, there, you know, there's that one island. I forget what it's called, but it's just like pe- these people have never had like human contact oh, right. outside the world. Human contact, I don't know how real that is, but. and like they're all like throwing spears and shit at people. Well, that's contact, right? Well, people are trying to come on the island, like, no, no, like, they don't speak English, nothing at all. Like, That'd be fucking, dope, though, right? Well, like, you could just show up with, like, a big fucking... Gun? A big fucking... <laughs> yeah, that's what I mean. Like, show up on a big military boat and be like, hey, uh, so your spears don't really hurt us. We're, yeah. we're coming down there. What if there's some, like... <laughs> doosh, 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 like, swat. Yeah. You guys have, like, this berry that is really good for people or some shit, like, some, yeah, 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 some yeah, random yeah. resource on the island. Yeah, it's like, yeah. we need that. Yeah, yeah. Plutonium berry. <laughs> yeah, it's like on some crazy, like, the soil is rich or something. I don't know, like, the cure for cancer is on that or something. The cure Whoa. for COVID is on there. Whoa. <laughs> well, we just got flagged. Imagine that? <laughs> we just got flagged. Damn, every episode, so I feel like we get flagged or something. Probably. Even though we don't actually get flagged, we're just saying that because we, we think we're cool. We might get, like, uh, yeah. shadow banned or some shit, right? Cool. It's, it's kind of close to being shadow banned. We're only getting like 15 yeah, views. Go like and subscribe, hey, motherfucker. We're shadow viewed. Shadow viewed, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> then you move up the shadow ban. <laughs> yeah. We're still, yeah, yeah. We're getting there, but fucking go like and subscribe, motherfuckers. Yeah, subscribe. Oh, kicking the dick. Yeah. We're getting there. Yep. Making, it, our, way, making our way to 60. It's the climb. Yeah. First 100 is the worst. So. Yeah, because I was watching another um, podcaster say that. Like, once you get to like, Hundred, and then once you do a thousand, it's just like it just picks up quicker yeah, and yeah, quicker. Yeah, because yeah. yeah. that's that good shit, you know. Well, we got that good shit. No, we fucking, definitely got that good shit, and we got. It's got a degree in thugonomics. <laughs> word life, <laughs> but actually, some more good Never shit. Do that. <laughs> <laughs> that's John Cena, man. Yeah, Classic man. John Cena gimmick. Never do it. <laughs> <laughs> what did you watch that Chris D'Elia clip? Listen. Yeah. With yeah. the guy <laughs> singing in the shoot. Oh, man. How funny is that? I'll see Chris Delia's laugh. Take him off. <laughs> <laughs> He's wearing shoes. Joe never shoes. made that move. 
<laughs> John never wore those shoes. And it's funny because I have bought like knockoff like designer shit or whatever, like nice stuff. And like, yeah. I mean, it still works, but like, yeah. you just have to f- acknowledge the fact that you're going to get fucking ripped or shred by some people. Yeah. That's all. Yeah. Some people are legit. I saw a video of like, imagine if one day, like, it was because things had kept uh, postponed. Like they had their wedding postponed a bunch of times. This are you talking this couple? Oh, are you hype? Is this a hypothetical couple? No, no, couple? this is like an actual couple. Okay. But I'm saying like hypothetically, if like you were in this situation or like okay. I was in this situation All as well, right. I just but like my wedding just got postponed. Yes. Okay. And then one day you're fucking someone knocked Walk your door. Walk me through it. So, so I, I knock your own door. Okay. <laughs> All right. Today you and Karen are getting married. I and am you, the wedding you had planned that you had no idea was coming is today. It is a complete surprise wedding. Why? Just because, like, I think that have like. Why is it happening today? Because that's the whole, whole point. Like, like a, my control. Like a surprise birthday party. Oh, a surprise like wedding. You, yeah, it's like, oh, this is a wedding now. Okay, it, okay, it's wedding it's day. Surprise! Like, you're getting married. Yeah, like. Yeah, it, I wouldn't like that. It was kind of like all your specifications. Though. It was like the wedding you guys wanted. Then you get knocking the door. Like, all right. Oh, okay. Today, so like, it'll just spring up on you. So it's almost like a reality TV show. Where it's like, oh my yeah. god, I would just love for to have this. And also, this. You, like, uh, be like, oh yeah, I'd love to have this be like, band play at my yeah. wedding. Wouldn't be like super tacky, but like, be hosted by. No, you, no you, it would be hosted by Come Ty on. Pennington. Interesting. I forgot that guy's <laughs> name, so I'm glad what you went it, with Ty him. Ty Pennington. Wow, I can't believe you remember that guy's name. No, I think you're right. Maybe Fuck it yeah. isn't. You stream it over, yeah. But either way, stream it over home edition. Yeah, yeah, yeah. same, right? Yeah. yeah. But yeah, that'd be that'd be interesting because it'd be like we got that lined up right here. If you're ready to do it, and they'd be like, I yeah, right. Hate this bitch though. Instead of like, <laughs> hey? I know it's still like about you, but it wouldn't make your whole wedding like about you per se. Like everybody else actually helped your wedding instead of like. I don't, I don't, okay, you, here you go some weddings. You just give the donation. Here's like, what oh, would happen for your honeymoon. Here's what would happen if the couple are too smart they'd look at each other and go hey we could just get divorced after if we wanted to because it's like this is a lot of money <laughs> <laughs> that we'd be saving so let's just take it <laughs> and party our ass yeah. <laughs> yeah. get, get a day to your like, all, yeah, all you know there'd be one guy that'd be like no I hate this bitch <laughs> yeah no it ain't happening I was nah. thinking about it and actually it's actually a good thing that he's getting postponed <laughs> oh thank god good. thank god you're here <laughs> now I can actually just break the news yeah now I have a witness I see it yeah <laughs> I have another family. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I am moving to Michigan that would be to my fucked. other family. Uh, isn't that fucked that you like hear those stories that like people can have like uh, t- another life and stuff? That, yeah. Like, what is that? And I'll see they're true, but I feel like I have a hard time believing those. It's like how? Um, probably because life. one... Someone's got to be in some serious denial, I think. You know, like the let's just say it's the husband and whatever. Well, wouldn't the wife have, has to be in some serious denial, I think, about what's really happening. Because like they must be gone for yeah, the classic all that cases time is like they're gone. For, got to got to go to work thing for a month, but like yeah, they yeah, got a work conference. So if they are like not going to work and they're just like seeing this other family, it's like wouldn't you be able to still be able to tell? that they're not making any money for this month <laughs> that they're away or whatever? Like, what kind of job do they have? Yeah, how does it, none of the parties know? That's what I'm saying. Like, <sighs> what are the, the other party might know. Like, the other party could be like, I. Right, but, but then how could it do that? They could be okay with it, too. They could just be okay with it because they could be really in love like with, with someone, right? Like, love can do that to people, right? Where it's just like... Yeah. Yeah, yeah, go back to your wife. I'll see you in a, whatever. Like, that's like a classic... A that's, fair that's situation crazy. on every. That's, that sounds like a crazy person. Well, yeah. If you probably. take that out of context, yeah, definitely. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we just watched that show Clickbait on Netflix. There's, yeah. there's like the guy was having an affair, and the girl was in love with him, even though she knew he was married and whatever, right? So it's like obviously that can happen. That's what. Yeah. Well, if, I'm basing that all on a TV yeah. show, but, you know. Yeah. Have you checked out Squid Game yet? I haven't, but I've been seeing people talk about it. I'm always iffy with. I watched Subtitles. the trailer. It looked really good. It looked like a show I could watch. Um, I didn't know if Karen could watch it, but now that I've been hearing that, like, like I was already hearing good things, but again, I just like could wear Karen watch the show. But literally, I think it's going on the most watched show on Netflix in like 
everywhere, like yeah. internationally. It's like I said, I'm not a big subtitles guy, but also there's I, I've heard times that you it, can put up with it. I've heard that it's a slow burn. Like it starts off slow. Oh yeah. And then it just takes off. Yeah. From what Have I've, you watched the trailer? Yeah. I, I've seen the trailer of it. Yeah. But like one, one of the other podcasts I watched, the guy said they watched it for his episode or something like that. Yeah, was, I was hearing about it on a podcast. Yeah. yeah. So <laughs> I'm definitely gonna check it out. Like I'm not not gonna watch all. I say it. that I might check it out, but I don't know. Like I just we're yeah. just watching that Midnight Mass right now. I've heard good things about that too. Is um, it all right? Um, I'd call this a slow burn. There's some moments that are good. Like it's this. It's like beep. beep. Uh, a little and I, I know it's gonna go. A little heartbeat. <laughs> Yeah, it's, gonna, it's just gonna go. It's, yeah, one episode is gonna fucking but escalate. All, the, all this though, like the. Part is, is it gonna be worth the? F- <sighs> the it's the f- just. It's pretty slow. I think we're like four or five episodes in, and like yeah. sure, like some shits happened. It's been a little predictable. You, you, you're cautiously buying it's low. Taking a little bit. Yeah, it's taking a <laughs> bit of a turn, and it's like, I'm still waiting for that. Aha! Like ah, this is good. You know. Yeah. Still waiting for that moment. Like it's done really well. The yeah. set's really cool. The Ju- island's cool. Just like cryptocurrency. Yeah, sure. It seems like that, how that's going. Anyways, yeah. that's what happened backwards. I was one of those people. Yeah. You're going to see this. I know I'm going to see this, but I look like a fucking idiot. Dude, you couldn't look worse. <laughs> like, I'm going to fuck like a shitty 90s movie. Oh my God, I was going to say, you look like you're in a music video <laughs> in the 80s. Like a hip hop, like an 80s yeah, hip hop. Oh, that's You know, fucking... Chic Fool by Goldfinger? Yeah. Chic that booty. <laughs> yeah, you look like you're on that. Ice, ice, baby. Chic Fool, Chic Fool. Shout out to anyone who knows that. Nobody probably knows that. <laughs> Nobody knows that. <laughs> the fact that we even know it is astonishing. It, yeah, it's questionable. It's astonishing. Yes. Like, if we ever meet another human that knows that song, we'll be like, have like a tattoo of it. It's like, what the fuck? We, did we just become best friends? <laughs> Pretty much. It would be one of those moments. I'm like, yo, Cheek fool, fucking bro. hats off to you. You know? Shake that booty. Make it nice Not and juicy. juicy. She is the name of the cut. Hit the floor, baby, and shake that <laughs> stuff. You pretty much compare it like, like Tupac. He looks a lot like him. Is it very like some gems don't be like are not properly shown. You know what? People, he, they, more people need to know about that song. That's well, what I'm yeah, trying to say. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Like, in it, a it, very, very awful way. Yeah, it needs more of a voice. <laughs> yeah. That's what I'm trying to, you know, get around at here. You know, oh man, Chris Stefano did an ad. I was listening to his podcast the other day with because he did one with Santino, and uh, yeah, one of his ads was for something. But he's like, it's so good that it made me go home and beat my wife or something. <laughs> it's like I could, It was so good that I went and committed domestic abuse and stuff. I was just like, only Chris, only Chris Stefano could fucking say something like that. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> Fuck. Hey, we'll, we'll get there. I, I followed another uh, a comedian from Toronto. It kind of does like kind of funny videos. And he, Who is it? Um, Neb, I, I can't pronounce his name. Like Neba, Neba Bez or something like that. He was, he was making like, not, not about TikTok. He's like, well, Tron- you made it pretty hard for me to look up. Yeah, Toronto Man's uh, like videos and stuff like that as well. Oh, uh, okay. But he's actually trying to be like a comic too. It's like he pulls a clip. He like, yeah, yeah. They drop it at school to like go all in on trying to go into career comedy. Oh. And I kind of like kind of struck a little chord of like inspiration and be like, fucking, not the animals are dropping out of school, but like <laughs> we went into. It like, makes Sam really want to clean out his locker and kick the kick rocks. No, very one thing. If I actually want to like, it's something I've always thought about too. Is like pursuing denim ba- by a, denim pursuing backpack. a career in some kind of comedy or some kind of that shirt sure helps. <laughs> it does. Fucking, <laughs> my uncle gave me this shirt. Well, I was given this shirt like posthumously. Your uncle Jimmy Buffett. No, I fucking the other uncle was like the only other pothead in the family. Uh, okay. So when he passed, like I guess this, I was just to is, be like, clear. I know me. that's not a Jimmy Buffett shirt. Okay, he's making that up. He told me like, name me one song by him. <laughs> by Bob Marley, <laughs> Jimmy Buffett. Because <laughs> I might have a hard time with the Jimmy Buffett, uh, Margaritaville. Yeah. Ways it again in Margaritaville. What's another one? That's all I need to know. That's all you know, isn't it? Uh, there's one more that's like there's huge, more, fucking, too, hugely know, fucking popular. The one I'm blanking on it now. <laughs> yeah, me too. But Is you know, cheek fool? 
Yes, actually. She's the original writer. She is the original, yeah. She Jimmy Buffett wrote she, Sheikful. Sheikful is actually a cover song. <laughs> Jimmy Buffett wrote Sheikful. It's one of those times when people only recognize a cover song than an actual, Whoa. like... Handling that mic like a big black dick. Pretty much, man. Like, I'm getting close to stroking it. <laughs> howl. <laughs> are, are you thirsty? She's getting close to howl, man. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, my, my throat is a little itchy. <laughs> <laughs> Could, I could scratch it. Oh. <laughs> yeah, like why? Why use my? It, it's actually closer if I do this and then use my fucking hand. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> oh, that's good. Even if like you have sex with men, you're still not gay. No, <laughs> not at all. Not according to that guy on the internet. I know. I, I'm that late to a TikTok video. Funny. Yeah. That video is funny. It is jokes, man. I like, just want to watch it again. And it's funny that he's like in a gym saying it too. <laughs> so funny. Like, what is that? Uh, yeah, some people and like, man. dude, you gay and it's fine. Yeah, like you should. You can say bisexual. If you're yeah, not. like you're fine. It's all good. It's all good, man. Yeah, you can be straight and still have sex with men. Like, oh, mm. oh, it's not straight, but no other things. Yeah, <laughs> it's kind of like this, <laughs> <laughs> not this. That's funny, right? That's funny. That's a good video. It is. Fucking. Poor guy. Oh, he probably got roasted by yeah. so many people. Oh, yeah. And so many people actually might, the people even probably got offended by that too. Like, what do you mean? You can't say that. <laughs> yeah, probably. Yeah, maybe this guy's even joking. Maybe he's, he's just he's, trolling. He's just trolling. It's a big, like, serious troll. troll. I mean, yeah. shout out to that guy. He trolled himself a bit, though. I think he shouldn't have been. You got what you got to do. Self deprecating troll. <laughs> <laughs> That's why he was in the gym, like yeah. there's mirrors everywhere. Like he can see himself. <laughs> well, because he has another family. Fucking, oh. this is how it all ties in the whole episode oh. here, man. He's got a double life. Yeah, with a husband and then a wife. But he's not gay. No, it's just a roommate. It's just a roommate. <laughs> <laughs> right, it's literally just a roommate. Just a roommate. Uh, right, That's like, right. I, I can say I've lived. I live with multiple men in my life. I'm not gay. Yeah. They're roommates. <laughs> <That's true. laughs> hey, you're looking for a roommate. Yeah, That's that all it is? Yeah. Go back to college. That's funny. <laughs> Fuck. Well, well, should we wrap it up, Sam? We can wrap up. Wrap up this. Wrap podcast, up this bitch. Episode, episode eighty nine. Eighty nine. You yeah. were just gonna say it. Yes, yeah, sir. So I know if you didn't say it in the beginning, but yeah. I feel like some of you don't need to say it. But yeah. subscribe. Yeah, subscribe. Uh, I got him, Sam. Comment. I got him. Yeah. <laughs> Smash that like button. <laughs> harass that subscription button. Yeah, harass it. Yeah. <laughs> Get a fucking sexual harassment and go to court on that subscribe <laughs> button. Yeah. Yeah, dude. And Get like, served for that subscribe button. Yeah. And then, Commit tax fraud for that subscribe button. And if you want extra time, just go hit the bell. You know? Yeah, I mean, hit the bell. That, at the stretch, on all accounts. No, hit but, the bell. Yeah, yeah. Ting, 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 ting. ting. If there's a ting, is maybe before pop that logo. Yeah, we should pop with that logo. We should fade out. Yeah, first. well, we're going to do both at yeah. the same time. Okay. We'll Ooh. pop up that logo. Ting. Ting. Peace.